หรอกอยู่ก็รู้แล้วนี่ว่าเป็นคนยังไงมันจะไปไหนไม่ต้องมึงเห็นไหมมึงทำเลยลงไปถ้ามึงไม่จ่ายมึงรู้ใช่ปะว่ามันจะเป็นไงมึงจ้างได้กูก็จ้างได้วะ่ะผู้ชมครับขอต้อนรับทุกท่านเข้าสู่รายการ Movie Guru รายการเพื่อคนรักหนังเหมือนเราสองคนครับชายเพราะเราสองคนนั้นจะมาช่วยคุณดูหนังเก่งขึ้นครับและนี่คือช่วง Movie Guru Focus ของเรานะครับชายครับโฟกัสของเราวันนี้เป็นตัวอย่างที่เขาบอกว่าเป็นหนังแนวทริลเลอร์กับ Coming of Age หรือว่าแนวระทึกขวัญการเปลี่ยนผ่านชีวิตของวัยรุ่นคนหนึ่งนะครับกับภาพยนตร์ที่มีชื่อที่แปลกมาก Where the Crawdads Sing นั่นเองครับเป็นภาพยนตร์ที่ดัดแปลงมาจากนวนิยายขายดีที่ติดเบสเซอร์ของ The New York Times ในปี2019และปี2020และประพันธ์โดยนักเขียนที่มีอายุมากที่สุดเลยนะครับเธอมีชื่อว่าเดลียโอเวนส์นั่นเองซึ่งเธอประพันธ์บทประพันธ์นี้แล้วตีพิมพ์ออกมาวางจำหน่ายในปี2018ซึ่งถือว่าประสบผลสำเร็จมากเพราะเป็นการเขียนครั้งแรกของเธอได้ซ้ำไปครับชายและนี่คือช่วง Movie Group Spotlight ของเราสปอตไลท์ของเรายังคงส่องอยู่กับความน่าสนใจของภาพเพียนเรื่อง DC League of Super Pets ครับชาย Do you know who this is? Crypto? Crypto the Super Dog. My name is Dave Burgess. What's up, dog? And I am the animation supervisor on DC's League of Super Pets. We really need a skip intro button. And here's his nose. Again, that same kind of soft triangle shape, like that. I like to put a little bit of a line down the middle of his nose because my dog has a line down the middle of her nose. So to me, that Feels really doggy. Well, look at you being a dog. Those cheeks that push up from the smile, like that, just darkening stuff in, kind of give him a, a little bit of furriness. Crypto has really, really short fur, but there's still, you know, he's a dog, so he does have a little bit of fur. So I don't think it's bad to show a little bit of the breakup in the line, like that. That is way out of line, fella. And then give him that collar line across here, the cape, which comes. Out of the collar and across the shoulder like that. Try and get those ear shapes looking real nice, and then adding a little bit more detail to the collar. That works real nice. So this is how it looks when you've added a bunch of detail. Wow, oh, look at you, all spiffy. Another thing that I really like doing when I can with a, a computer like this, I like to add a little bit of color to the drawing because it makes the character really, really come alive. You bet on if I was alive. I'm going to turn off my rough drawing, and I'm going to add some colors to Crypto. His color is a soft white with a little bit of tan to it. So I'm going to color him in like that, and then down to his chest. It's also nice to add a little bit of detail for like shadows. Recede into shadows. Recede into shadows. Like the inside of the ear, you want to see a little bit of shadow where the cheek is, and a little bit of shadow underneath the jaw on the neck. So by doing a little bit of that, it makes your character look more dimensional. His nose is kind of a pinky color. He's got white on his eyes like that, and this is actually really important for Crypto. He's got kind of toffee-colored irises. That looks really, really nice. And you can see how that kind of ties in with all the other colors on his fur. And then he has what we call eye highlights. Putting these little white dots really add to the appeal and make Crypto look really, really nice. So it's always important to remember to put those little highlights on there. You can put a little bit of highlight on top of the nose like that. His collar is gold, so I'm going to do kind of a yellowy color for that. There we go. That's better. And then, if you want to, you can darken up parts of it like this part around that hope shape. And then the last thing that you want to give him is his red cape that comes off his shoulders like this. And then one of the last things I like to do is I like to put him in a space. I think having like some blue sky behind him would look really good. I'll go down a layer, and then I can put in a really nice, just quick, kind of loose background color like that, and it makes him really pop. You see, totally fine. So that's a really simple way to draw crypto. Oh, one more thing. It's been really, really fun learning about Crypto the Super Dog, working on Super Pets, and I really like figuring out how to draw him. So I hope you can enjoy figuring out how to draw your version of Crypto. So have fun and good luck. Ah!